the Valley of Eternal Blossoms, home to many creatures of all shapes and sizes. However, for this video, we will be discussing one creature in particular, one very elusive beast that is renowned for its multicolored appearance. This beast, of course, is Portent. Portent is a rare quillion that comes in a variety of different colors, four to be exact, red, blue, purple, and green. Each different color of Portent seems to have a unique set of eyes to match. For example, Portent's purple color appears to have blank white eyes, while Portent's green color seems to have bright blue eyes. The main reason why Portent is so difficult to find is because he covers a great deal of distance along the Valley of Eternal Blossoms. He starts at the top right corner, and then slowly zigzag twists and turns, and finally ends up at the top left. But the problem is that while he's exploring, he enters a lot of phased zones, and that can be almost impossible to find him. Unless, of course, you're attuned to the phased area. But if you're not, then it's gotta be a bit difficult to find this guy. Just like all rare elusive hunter challenges in Missa Pandaria, simply follow his tracks, come to the end of his tracks, shoot a flare, and you should be able to find this guy. That is, unless somebody has already tamed him. Then you're kind of out of luck. Moving on! What's interesting about Portent is that his spawning location is actually right next to a dungeon called the Mogushan Palace. Inside the palace, there appears to be a clan of Mogu who call themselves the Girthen. Alongside the Girthen are two separate clans called Kargish and Harthak. That being said, out of all three clans, the Girthen appear to be the only group of Mogu who have actually adopted the companionship of Aquilian to aid them in combat. You're probably asking yourself, what exactly does all this have to do with Portent? Well, to put it simply, because his starting zone is actually right outside of the Mogushan Palace, there is a belief that perhaps Portent was actually inside the Girthen clan as one of the companions. After you defeat all three clans in the Mogushan Palace, they begin to slowly put their hatreds towards you away and begin to focus on the opposing clans. It's possible during the sudden outbreak that the Girthen clan could have actually been defeated by the opposing two clans. After seeing his Mogu partner fall in combat, it's possible that Portent could have escaped from the Mogushan Palace in hopes to seek safety and shelter from the opposing two clans. And thus, his journey begins. Well, that's about gonna do it for this video. If you enjoyed it, then giving it a friendly thumbs up wouldn't hurt. Also, if you're new to the channel, then subscribing would be even better. But, as always, this is Zolo, wishing you all happy hunting.